Hey guys and welcome back to Let's Play Dead State Reanimated. This is day three and we just brought in a lot of antibiotics to help Doug. And right now I'm trying to locate Doug. It's not in the basement anymore. He's not upstairs, apparently. Well, he was unconscious and sick, so Maybe he is recovering somewhere. Davis and Anita repairing the refrigerator. Let's actually check on the status on that. Nine hours still remain. And that means it will not be completed today. Right, no sign of Dirk. Davis slacking. He should be helping with the refrigerator. Let's get some more supplies and stuff so there is still a building in this location we did clear no we did not clear this area because there is a residential area with armed occupants church we could maybe check the church bunch of undead it is close by more or less and there was an open door I think I think we already dealt with this alarm, maybe. Rene does have science at level 3. Right, now I understand how one of the fights resulted in the enemy getting poisoned. Science adds contact poison to weapons. It only happened one time though. Right, I don't think we actually dealt with the alarm. But it doesn't give me the option to deal with it. For some reason. Right, let's head to the church. This door was open, I think. Yes. Bunch of undead. Maybe clear the outside first. Right. <laughs> Didn't really want to trick wanted to trigger that. Uh, 
that's a lot of undead. But they're all inside. Let's just get away. Is that actually possible? No. That's not ideal. Can get one attack in. Get two attacks with the bat. And now we just need to reposition. stay inside the church apparently would be nice to have a grenade or something like that guess they are all punched up here yeah we could use the firearm but Let's maybe not get more on that. parts let's maybe first take care of the undead here let's check if you can actually attack diagonally you can, alright. Ammunition for a rifle. So the undead are all here. I hope. Locked door. Rene should be able to pick the lock.
right, nothing here. This door is also open. Lock doors. Maybe we don't want to actually open the door. That's it for the church. Take care of this undead, and then Rene can do a lockpick. few luxury items Adrenaline shot is useful Otherwise the house is empty. Right, there's another place here. Already checked that out. I think that is it for this map. Check out this building, the church and this area. And let's see, well there's still plenty of time to visit another location. This is the area with the armed 
occupants in the residential area. We are probably still underpowered. Need more ranged weapons, I think. And there's still a store we can search in the Brady Pharmacy area. Well, let's maybe try to find another location. Abandoned cars. Well, sure. Don't have a choice but to enter the location. Bunch of undead. Yeah, it would be nice to get some uh, fuel. It's kind of hidden. Right, more there. Joe can stay where he is. Move back. Yeah, miss again, of course. Why not? Badly wounded, only badly wounded. So there's one here, one here. And two here. Only this car does have any loot. Yeah, I'm not sure I want to fight them all. But the only exit point on this map is here, so we <laughs> actually need to. Come on! And Joel again goes for the misses because why not? John will loot the car. Hmm. <laughs> that was the idea, at least. Well, at least we can get to the exit. Always useful. John try to loot the car. And 
let's get out of here can probably do this without being noticed p.m. downtown San Saba right the bison was west of San Saba could check it out for easy stuff if there is any and then head back I guess Let me quickly change the audio a bit. Wow, that's a lot of undead. Locked door and indestructible, sort of. This door is unusable. Another church. Yeah, I don't want to bash in the door here with the sea of undead. What skill was used? Mechanical skill. Uh, she has a skill of two. Can increase it to three. But I rather wait and increase medical, or maybe one of the combat skills. Wow, six skill points available. That's a lot. can get survival to the next level and get a new perk increase melee or start working on negotiation or ranged maybe focus on survival first getting to 10 
for the companion, the animal companion. So we cannot get into this door. This door is not usable. Can only get here if we have a character with sufficient mechanical skill. Or if you clear out the entire area, <laughs> which will take quite a while. More undead. Yeah. Great. This is a little bit too much for now. Probably time to head back. Not a super productive day. Well, we did get all the needed antibiotics for Dirk, so job done, I guess. A road through a rural area. Could check it out. Well, we have no choice again. Basically, no loot and no option to avoid the fight. That's great. Wounded. Yeah, let's. Play the waiting game. bolts <laughs> badly wounded I don't think we can kill her in this turn. Rene will have one attack available. All right. Can avoid that guy. Wow. <laughs> Come on. Can we? We cannot avoid all these encounters. Wow, that's horrible. And there is no loot at all. Completely. Without any. Payoff at all. That's unfair. Yeah, that's not really what I wanted.
a bandage. Can we escape? Good. Uh, let's get out. Back to the shelter. So not much. Well, five gallons of fuel, that's useful. Two special items. And still no sign of Doug. Let's well, maybe keep the adrenaline. And Maybe the Stuporax and Sutinum also. Just in case. Fill up the Medic satchel. And the unique items available, the marijuana, sleeping pills. We don't know who that's for. Same goes for the bourbon and the spices. That's all the nine millimeter ammo we have. Let's maybe get these shotgun shells. Maybe give Renee a gun. Right, that's it for the inventory management. Let's end the day, I guess. We are done. We found the antibiotics. Can talk to Elaine again. It was so close to me. It would have been me. It should have been me. I wish I had died that day. If you want to die, could you stop eating our food so there's more for us? Yeah. Maybe you survived for a reason. Maybe. I need some time alone, please. Okay, feel better. Let's be as positive as possible. And I don't think Doug is recovering somewhere here. So maybe we will see him in the morning. End of day three. D 
the refrigerator repair should be done tomorrow morning, nine o'clock, something like that. And we didn't gain a lot of food at all. Antibiotics used today, five, wow. That's all for Doug. I guess. Remaining 12, fuel remaining 25, so six days. Morale increased a little bit. And we have food for... We have enough food remaining for four days. All right, so food priority. I was just checking on the food supply this morning. To be honest, the pantry seem better days. Yes, I just noticed that too. We have enough food for four days, Joel. And now a place where we might be able to stock up. Only, well, I don't know how safe it is. Mark it on my map. If we have no other choice, we'll check it out. Marked it down for you. Let me know if you want to head over with you. Well, thanks, Joel. I'll come get you later. <coughs> Let's see if Elaine is a bit better. She looks at you timidly and sobs. Just go away. <laughs> Yes, that's it. That's it. Talk to me. Or why help me understand. Talk to me. Let's go for that. Why are you making this so hard? You of all people should. She breaks down and goes into a crying fit. You don't think you'll be able to talk to her? again for a while right Elaine we'll try this again later maybe end of the day <coughs> possibly there should be news on the duck situation I guess hopefully Maybe Davis has any new information, or otherwise Rene might be able to fill us in. Right, that's something for the next episode now. For now, I'll make a cut here. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.